I'm a rolling stone Bound to roam Come the morning Or I'll be gone Or in rain Or to hear that train There's a car Just get on I don't know about you, but I'm pretty excited to start using these new cotton harvesters. Yeah, these things look great. I can't wait to use them. Oh, it's red light. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. I think I'm going to make it. Maybe. Can I squeeze through here? Maybe. It's funny. You know, for two harvesters that would have done the bailing itself, they wanted to charge me a million dollars per. A million per? Holy crap. How much did these cost you? Only like 500000 Dang. All right. But you know what, I think, because we ended up walking away with three harvesters, two buggies, and a compact, I think we walked away pretty good. Yeah, this is great. Now, is this the field to the right that we have to harvest? Yeah, but we're just going to go ahead and take them directly to the farm. All right. We'll go to the farm first and unload there because all the other equipment's there. Gotcha. Looks like that's, there's an individual up the road. I slow down a little bit up there. Oh, no brakes, like no brakes, no brakes. I'm going to run into you. Please don't run into me. Oh, I was so close to running into you. If you don't hit somebody, hit Chris. All right, next time. I next like time. his vehicle. All right, now this is the fun part. Oh, boy. How are we going to get in there? Swing wired, I guess. Uh, just like we did the first time. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh yeah, there she goes. Yeah. You might need to open up the yard just a little bit. For what? This is my last day. I guess it's your last day. You don't need to. And all the open yard is like right here. So you don't That's really need it. That's true. We should have gone in the other way. Oh, you just stopped. You're supposed to pull it beside me, not behind me. Oh, sorry, jeez. Beach ash out there. And two more cotton pickers to call our own. Holy Toledo. Now we just need people to run this equipment. Yeah, did you call everybody else and have them come over? I made some phone calls. I'm not 100% sure. All right. If they gonna make it or not, I mean, we'll, we'll see. We're just gonna shut that off right there. And look at all this beautiful equipment. You got some nice John, all John Deere here. Yeah, looking We need great. to start choosing. You know what we need to start doing? What's that? We need to choose the tractors that's going to run on that on the buggies. Oh, I got a tractor I want to use. Unless you have a better one. So, I think for the compactor, we use this old girl back here. Oh, for sure. Yep. So, I mean, compactor, that's an easy choice. Yep. And then, of course, for the buggies, I think we use... The 3040, 340, and we use the 8R. How many buggies do we have? Two, three, two? Two. Two, all right. Two buggies, and so I think those are two good tractors to go on those. Yeah, I'll hop in the 340 here. Get that hooked up. Yeah, let's go ahead and get that hooked up. Um, Let me see if I can call Chris, because I know he's down the road. Yep. Hello? Hey, are you coming over here today or not? Well, I'm on the road. I think. Did you see me? Did you see me when you drove by? Yeah, we saw you. We didn't know what you were doing. Yeah, what were you doing? I got a blown tire. <laughs> of course you did. Yeah, I mean, I'm heading out of town. I got a blown tire. I, I, <clears throat> heading out of town? Hold on. You're supposed to come help us Wait today. Wait a minute. I know. I, I, well, I was planning on leaving right after, so I'm going to leave my truck there. I got a, the repair guy's coming with a new tire, so. I think it'll be okay. So he's gonna he'll fix it and we got time. Okay. Yeah, so I gotta get I gotta go right after we're done. I gotta get out of town. 
You're getting out of Dodge, uh, huh? Yeah, I'm done. Huh. Where are you going? Do you know yet? Just, uh, you know, across the river a little bit. It's a couple hour drive, but not too bad. All right. Okay. Are you, did you get that information that all of us did about that place that's having a massive amount of farmers getting out of the land there? Yes. Okay. Because I think I'm one up going there. They talking about the land's cheap. It's a nice, good ground out there. Might be worth it. It is. I think it will be. All right. Well, I mean, at least we got you here now. I mean. What are these what are big yellow things? So, this is... This is your compactor. This actually compacts all the hay. I mean, not hay. This compacts all the cotton into square bales. These two are called cotton buggies. Basically, you unload the harvest, cotton harvesters into the buggies, and the buggies unload into the compactors. Oh, hey. It's like a three step process. Listen, it was either pay $500,000 for all this equipment. Or pay two million dollars for two harvesters that does all this in one go. I like the one go personally, but it's not my money either. So I didn't have two million dollars, okay? <laughs> and I was not about to go get a million dollar loan for one. All right, I called the three the three forty. That's mine. I'm using this. You want to do you want to do buggy? Okay, I'll do buggy. Yeah, I'll take I'll take one of the harvesters. I was about to say I was kind of leaning towards doing a buggy. Up the tank, cranking up the radio, playing old Hank. It ain't that long till I'm back at the farm. I'm pulling up the truck down at the dock. It's time to do some cruising, baby. Get a little stuck. It's a Saturday joy ride. Percy Feast is the spot. We're on a boat, we're feeling fine. Boys, I ain't gonna lie, we almost didn't make this long enough. We had plenty of room. Could have got two more. Yeah. 
plenty of space. Hey. And how do we solve these things? <laughs> well, nose game. Not it. Nose goes. Not it. Not it. Well, it's called I'm gonna hire a trucking company to come in here and haul all these off. Who's that? Either I'm gonna hire a Brody trucking or I'm gonna hire some local guy. Well, it's uh, it's about $120,000 per bale charge for me, so. So I'm gonna hire a local. <laughs> yeah, sounds like it. All right, well, boys, let's try to get let's get everything that loaded up, like set out the bottom of the field, so that the other guys can come pick up this equipment. All right. Because they're going to need it for the fields they're about to start working on. Alright guys, we just wrapped up cotton, cotton harvest here. I think this is going to do it for this one, guys. We've got a little more uh, beans to harvest and maybe some silage to harvest. I'm not sure yet. Uh, I might leave it for the uh, next owner. I'm not sure. But yeah, we're pretty much wrapping this series up here. Probably one more episode out of it. And then we are be we're going to be moving on to the next map. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit that like button and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next one. Thanks, guys. I'm a rolling stone Bound to roll Come the morning Or I'll be gone Or in rain Or to hear that train There's a car Just get on I'm a pack my grief.